Wow. There's a beholder here. That look in your eye. You're someone that has trouble doing crosswords, aren't you? <laughs> I love working on the newspaper. Oh. The news. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. Oh, what a great newspaper. <laughs> when I was younger, <laughs> my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. <laughs> look, she's smoking. I thought they were a waste oh, of time. Oh, yeah. I see. But look at me now. <laughs> I'm the number one word search creator in the entire under <laughs> underground. <laughs> Gosh dang it. Monster History Part 4. Fearing the humans no longer, we moved out of our old city home. We braved harsh cold, damp swampland, and searing heat until we reached what we now call our capital. I feel, New home. I feel like that's a ref. Again, our king is really bad at names. I feel like that's a reference to something. What? The swamps? It's a school report about monster funerals. Yeah. Monster funerals, technically speaking, are cool uh, as heck. Technically, yeah. Uh, well, technically, yeah, uh, cool. When monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. Oh. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on that person's favorite <laughs> thing in the entire world. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Forever. Forever. <laughs> uh, am I at the page minimum yet? I'm kind of sick of writing this. Hmm. While monsters are mostly made of magic, human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us. I mean, yeah, you are just a kid killing, like, whatever. But they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. Ha <laughs> ha! They'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. Ooh. I thought that was going to list more things. Here I am, writing this book. A person comes in and picks up the book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry. I'm still writing that one. She's called over to you. You did this one already. That was the monster. Oh, character. I meant to skip that one. Whoops. Mm-hmm. What part of that's a reference? The king being bad at names? No. Or like what? Like, all of it just seems like a reference to something. Monsters' bodies are attuned to their soul because they are made of magic, etc. <laughs> I thought you were gonna. I thought you were gonna go without. <coughs> so I did the latter half. I'm sorry. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken, <laughs> and the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. Therefore, therefore, if a being, if a being with a powerful stroll, soul, struck with the desire to kill, um, let's end that chapter. Ooh, that's some foreshadow right there. Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made of. <laughs> but the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. <laughs> I get it! People are... suck. 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 <laughs> Beat you to it. Uh, do you think you want to say before continuing? Because to the right is a uh, progressive Oh, and this path. is Sans' house. Huh? No, it's just Sans and Papyrus' nah, house in their shed. Nah. Sans lives there. Off the... What is the save point? Back it's, here. It's, yeah. By the box. Boxing. Determined. There we go. 113 minutes. I'm counting down the minutes. I'm counting down the moments. I'm counting down the seconds. Ten. Nine. There's the ice in the background. And the foreground. What? Where? I can't see it. <laughs> I can't see it. There's something in the way. Oh. Human. Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Well, we don't know who this is. Oh yeah, I should do a mystery voice. Feeling fun! <laughs> no. The joy of finding another pasta lover. Oh my. The admiration for another's puzzle solving skills. Oh, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. Oh yeah. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. Mm-hmm. 
After all, I am very great. I I don't I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I I pity you, lonely human. Mm -hmm. Worry not. You shall be lonely no longer. Oh, cool. Friends? I, the great papyrus, will be your... Acquaintance. No. No. This is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus. Uh, Pappy. The newest member Remember. of the Royal Guard. The Gord. Papyrus blocks the way. Ooh. <gasps> <laughs> What? F f flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings! <laughs> yep. Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. <laughs> I can make spaghetti! Yeah. Oh no! You're meeting all my standards! I guess this means I have to go on a date with you? Let's date later, after I capture you. Hmm. What? Papyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Uh okay. Remember, Sans was like, he's not dangerous, even if he tries to be. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Oh no! Let's date later, what? after I capture you! <laughs> Papyrus is thinking about what to cook for his date. Ooh. You flirt, but to no avail. Seems acting uh, won't escalate this battle. Darn. Let's stay later. May I, you, come on. I, uh, I, I'm, I'm really... You gotta meet me halfway nah. here. Yeah. I gotta punch him. Papyrus dabbed some bone cologne. <laughs> he dabbed. Bone cologne. <laughs> Papyrus dabbed. Uh... <laughs> 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 Bone cologne zone. So I gotta punch him. You don't have to. I only hit him twice. So you're serious. I have to. Then let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. You didn't have to, Dex. You could have done spare. Or the other axe thing you didn't try either. Square. Oh shit! It's blue spare, not square. Oh. Oh. Huh? Huh? You're blue now. What? What does this mean? That's my attack! <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. Uh oh, what? Those don't do anything. You can spare over and over and fight them. What? Ah, oh, I suck. Hmm, I wonder what I should wear. Oh, I see. Papyrus stabs MTT <laughs> brand Bishy Cream behind his ear. What? Papyrus is too bitty. bitty. Okay. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. Papyrus stabs MTT brand Anime Powder behind his ear. Anim. 43. Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Oh, will that make me red? <laughs> These bones will prove to be a match for you, MTC uh, brand cute juice. Why? <laughs> to prepare for his date. I can almost taste my future popularity. Pop. Oh. What? what did a thing it came from the right? Ah, uh. yeah. Papyrus stabs MTT brand attraction slime behind his ear. Oh, cool. Papyrus, head of the royal guard. 
Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh. I planned Empire that. Empire Stabs MTT brand beauty yogurt behind his ear. What the heck? Papyrus Unparalleled Spaghetti. Oh. For family. Uh, oh, suck. Papyrus realizes he doesn't have ears. Oh my. This whole time. Undyne will be really proud of me. Yep, yep. Uh oh, whoops. Kinda pressed the wrong <clears throat> button there. That's alright, mm. you're learning from your mistakes. Papyrus is trying hard to play it cool. Mm. We play it cool. Yeah. yeah. The king will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Papyrus is preparing a bone attack. Ooh. That's, oh man, you really can prepare now. My brother will, well, he won't change very much. Oh, I forgot to equip the armor. Man. I am bad. Did you? It's in your inventory. You can put it on. Papyrus is still trying hard to play it cool. You know what? The mandana. Oh, is it the mandana? Yeah. You equipped manly bandana. And it replaces... I'll have lots of admirers, but... It replaces your um, default armor item, which is a bandage, and you can reapply it for 10 HP because... I don't know. Papyrus is tackling. <laughs> cackle, cackle. Whoop. You know what? 45. Would anyone like me as sincerely as you? Does he not realize I'm beating him up? He's beating you up too. To capture you! Oh jeez. Papyrus is rattling. Rattling his bones. Someone bones. like you is really rare. Me old bones. Let me tell you the story of me old bones. Pappy! <laughs> oh, I did it too early. And dating might be kind of hard. Play it cool. Uh -huh. After you're uh, captured and sent uh, away. <laughs> My hand is cold, so I couldn't move it quickly. <laughs> oh gosh dang it. Papyrus, he's still, he's still so... Uh, 41. Behold! My oh, special attack! Hopefully it sucks. Oh. Yeah. Oh. What the heck? Oh! What the heck? <laughs> Sands. That's my special attack. Hey, you stupid dog. Oh, it's gonna bite him. Do you hear me? It's gonna attack him. Stop munching on that bone. Oh, bone. it's gonna attack him. Hey, oh. what are you What are you doing? <laughs> Come back here with my special attack. Oh, well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Price is getting ready for a regular attack. Serious? Do I have to... Dex, remember what the frog had said? He was like, sometimes you'll have to spare if, even if it's not yellow. Sir, here's an absolutely <laughs> normal attack. Oh, right. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Holy, holy moly. Oh, no. No. No, 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 no! <laughs> what? <laughs> you have one health left. Ah! <laughs> what the heck? Well, oh. it's clear you can't <laughs> defeat me. Oh. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore I, the great papyrus, elect to grant you pity. 
I will spare you, human. Oh. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. Oh. Oh. Literally, the entire thing would have been the same whether you were ha attacking him every time or hitting spare every time. Oh. New hoo hoo. Wait. Oh, so it was just till I was almost dead? It was, um. Or. Yeah, what? No, it was, um. It's a certain amount of moves. It's a certain amount? Yeah. So I could have killed him. I guess. Yeah, if you could, I had, yes, like, you could have killed him. Oh if you, if you attacked him just then, instead of sparing, you could have killed him. If you choose to kill him, you'll kill him. Ooh. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend Quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? Let's be friends, or what a loser. <laughs> what a loser! Uh! Hmm. This is a pretty, uh, pretty difficult decision. He did almost kill me, so let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? No. Well then... Not really. I guess... I guess I can make an allowance for you. Cool. Wowie, Wowie, we haven't even had our first date, yep. and I've already managed to hit the friend zone. <laughs> Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. Yep. I hereby grant you permission to pass <laughs> through, and I'll give you directions to the surface. Mm. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. See. Then... When you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except for someone with a powerful soul. Ooh. Like you. Ooh. That's why the king wants to acquire a human. Ooh. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Ooh. Punk soul brother. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Mm. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. Oh, oh great. He's... Oh. Well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. <laughs> I am certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Oh, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta... Oh. He... He... 